Hello. Spencer's asking it to me. Altair, it is good to see you. And in one piece. You as well, friend. I am sorry for your troubles. Think nothing of it. A few of your brothers were here earlier, in fact. Oof, if you'd heard the things they said, I'm certain you'd have slain them where they stood. It's quite all right. Yes, you've never been one for the creed, have you? Is that all? I'm sorry. Sometimes I forget myself. What business brings you to the mass? A man named Tamir. Al Muallim takes issue with the work he does. I meant to end it. I trust you have searched the area to better understand your enemy. Yes. Here's what I've learned. Tamir rules over the Souk El Salah. He makes his fortune selling arms and armor, and is supported by many in this endeavor. Blacksmiths, traders, financiers. He's the single largest death dealer in the land. And have you devised a way to rid us of this blight? A meeting is being arranged at Souk El Salah to discuss an important sale. They say it's the largest deal Tamir has ever made. He'll be distracted with his work. That's when I'll strike. Your plan seems solid enough. I give you leave to go. <laughs> Let Al Mualim's will be done. You may rest here until you are ready. Thank you. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Excuse of a lazy or incompetent man. Which are you? Neither. What I see says otherwise. Now, tell me, what do you intend to do to solve this problem of ours? These weapons are needed now. I see no solution. The men work day and night, but your client requires so much, and the destination, it is a difficult route. Were it that you could produce weapons with the same skill as you produce excuses? I have done all I can. It is not enough. Then perhaps you ask too much. Too much? I gave you everything. Without me, you would still be charming serpents for coin. All I ask in return was you fill the orders I bring you. And you say I ask too much? <laughs> you dare disrespect me? Peace, Tamir. I meant no insult. Then you should have kept your mouth shut! No! Stop! Stop? <laughs> I'm just getting started! No! Stop! You came into my souk! Stood before 
my men and dared to insult me? No. Leave the body. Let this be a lesson to the rest of you. Think twice before you tell me something cannot be done. Now get back to work. There's a dude. The boy. Pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. Where did you learn your craft? Let me show you everything I have. Down and try again. And if it comes out just as boldly, every you gets melted down next. now, my friend. You'll not profit from suffering any longer. You think me some petty death dealer, suckling at the breast of war? A strange target, don't you think? Why me, when so many others do the same? You believe yourself different, then? Oh, but I am. For I serve a far nobler cause than mere profit. Just like my brothers. Brothers? Ah, but he thinks I act alone. I am but a piece, a man with a part to play. You'll come to know the others soon enough. They won't take kindly to what you've done. Good. I look forward to ending their lives as well. Such pride. It will destroy you, child. He's almost perfect. Then that beggar lady thing. We 
word has reached me of your victory, Altair. You have my gratitude and my respect. Thank you. It is a shame that the other assassins continue to hold you in such poor regard. Rafiq, I do not care what the others think of me. As you wish, Altair. You should bring news of your victory to Al Malin. I'm certain he has more work for you to do. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Out of the machine, Mr. Miles. What's the matter, Doc? Miss Stillman is once again insisting I let you rest. So bright. So, feel like telling me who put the stick up his ass? We have a deadline. One week. Well, six days now. Deadline? I can't talk about it. Man, put yourself in my shoes. I'm being held hostage by a group of scientists, at least I think you're scientists, and forced to spend all day in some crazy ass machine. You won't tell me what you're looking for or why you want it, but I'm supposed to be thanking you for keeping me alive. This is so fucked. Sorry, but it is. What do you want me to do? Hmm, let's see. I don't know. Maybe give me some answers? I can't. And it's better this way. Safer. Safer for who? Both of us. Let's go, Mr. Miles. Time's wasting. Where's Lucy? Oh, don't worry. She'll be with us soon enough. So why are you doing all this, Doc? What are you hoping to accomplish? You turn the television on lately? Read the newspaper? never cared much for that stuff. Then, let me sum it up for you. The world's a mess. It's pathetic, really. You've seen it firsthand yourself. A thousand years between you and your ancestor, and society remains just as barbaric, just as stupid. And your point is... Order, Mr. Miles. The world needs order. That is what we're working towards, and that is what you're helping us to achieve. <laughs> you expect me to believe you're building a better tomorrow? That's exactly what we're doing. The human race calls out for direction. They want to know why they're here, what they're meant to do. Well, we're going to tell them. And once they understand how to live their lives, everything will be better. Better how? An end to all conflicts, large and small. Isn't that what you assassins strive for? Peace in all things? I told you, I'm not an assassin. Right, right. I still don't see where I fit into things. In time, Mr. Miles. In time, you'll understand. Or you won't. I don't care either way, as long as you show us where it is. Where what is? Sorry I'm late. Ready to go? Yes, we are.
Let's go. Use vigilantes you have freed to block your pursuers and break them. You've done well, Altair, and I'm confident that this is but the first of many successes. Tamir spoke as if he knew you well. He implied my work had a larger meaning. Significance comes not from a single act, but the context within which it is performed. The consequences born of it. Then is there more I need to know? Altair, your greatest failure was born of knowing too much. If I choose to withhold information, it is only to ensure you do not make the same mistake a second time. I see. No, you don't. And it will remain this way until you've learned your lesson. Still, you have performed competently. And as such, I restore a rank and will return a piece of your equipment. Go now, either to Akka or Jerusalem. There are men in both cities who require your attention. The Bureau leaders can tell you more about what needs to be done. Altair, it seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield a blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. Are you sure you know how to use that? Ooh, I see something. Isn't the first after mission uh done it at the first time to to the guards. Break their line of sight.
is it this? He's going to run into someone. I believe after we've been to all the places once, we could fast travel. But if you guys always want me to go through the kingdom, I will go through the kingdom. I don't care. Also, I think Edgar has, or Edgar has the coolest looking soldier. What's going on? I definitely need to get spotted here. An assassin! Kill him! Don't die! 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 And we didn't run into any tech players, wouldn't we? Yeah, 
When you are exposed, use sharp turns or climb over buildings to break your pursuer's line of sight. Oh! <laughs> 
Is that the last of them? I hope so. Still, best not to take any chances. I'll hurry home. Don't think I'll leave it again anytime soon, either. You've done me a kindness, young man. Be assured I won't forget it. Who did this? Responsible for this. Here we are in an update. Please, sir, have any money? The family's sick and dying. Could you spare a few coins? Stop! You must not stop! <laughs> 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 Is somebody breaking a pot and I wasn't involved? What a strange man. Pathetic. The old man's gonna cry. were half as brave as you. I'll see to it that they hear this tale and know what it is to be a true hero. Dark days indeed. Who's responsible for this? Ah. Double cost you your life. That hurt. You 
your presence. Rodoha Alei! I'll cut you down! I'll die for that! Ah, Altai. A little bird told me you'd be paying a visit. Al Mualam has ordered the execution of Ganyet and Aprus, and so here I am. What can you tell me about him? He is the Grand Master of the Knights Hospital, and surely keeps his quarters in their district. Beyond that, I cannot say. I suggest you search the city. See what you can learn from the people. Tell me where they gather and I'll see what I can find. The public gardens north of here, or what's left of them, are as good a place as any to begin. There's an abandoned market northwest as well that merits watching. And Maria of Jehoshaphat's church to the west remains a popular meeting place. These three locations should be sufficient for your needs. I appreciate the information, Rafiq. It will be put to good use. See that it is. Yes, it is. Hey, we're gonna cut it here. Thanks for watching. Bye.